welcome or welcome back to Banished. I had a new idea I wanted to try out where we're going to make everything kind of spread out and start with a really spread out build. I was just kind of thinking about it in passing and was thinking, hey, that might be a decent idea. So let's look at the map a little bit here and see where we should put some things like maybe a hunting lodge or I guess our first deal should be a fishing spot right here. We're gonna press R to spin this thing around. I wonder if I should put it somewhere else. I guess that's fine. We can put it right there. And we actually are gonna wanna clear cut some of this stuff real quick. Um, we have a lot of stuff to start with, but I wanted to build up, you know, like a hunting cabin somewhere else. It's, it's kind of weird that we have... I feel like this isn't a very good spot, because we have a lot of little rivers coming through. I think I might get a new seed and see how it looks. This looks a little bit tough. Um, so let's quit, and then let's, let's generate a new seed here, and see what we end up with. I didn't really like that we didn't have any open area. Alright, this is already looking a lot better. Alright, cool. So here, we can go ahead and get a hunting cabin right off the get. So let's build our hunting cabin right here, try to maximize that area. And let's put up a fishing dock as well. Maybe at this area here. Where it'll kind of maximize this little river. Or should I do it here on this bend? I think here on the bend is more interesting. And then along with that, let's go ahead and set up some of our people to do some work. So, I think the laborers will put stone and logs in, and then we need some builders to actually assemble the stuff. So I'm pretty sure that's how it works. Let's go ahead and turn down this volume of just a hair. I think it may still be a little bit, a little bit high. We'll drop it all down a little bit. All right, cool. It still might be a little bit high. Let's do a little bit more ambient volume down. Okay, that looks like it should work. All right, it looks like it's a reasonable volume. <clears throat> um, let's go ahead and cut some of this stuff down. Maybe like that just clean around our building real quick and then we'll have plenty of wood I wonder if they do they get the resources if it's blocking the the bottom of the building let's get one guy building I don't think that they're able to build yet but okay yeah stone and logs are getting put in there by the laborers so that's cool we have one hunting cabin over here and then we're actually going to want to put a forestry lodge next to that thing. Let's go ahead and put our forestry lodge right here. That looks good. That way that'll synergize with the hunting cabin well. And let's also try to get a gathering hut somewhere. Wonder if that should also just be right up here. That looks pretty good. So we'll put a gathering hut there as well. 
think we're going to need a couple houses down in that area, so let's build up a house there. Lots of stone and iron to build a stone house. <clears throat> I don't know if it makes sense to build stone houses from the beginning, but maybe we do. Maybe we just build the boarding house. Temporary place for the homeless to live. What is that, 145? 16 wood and 8 stone. The boarding house seems pretty decent. I think that may be a decent spot for it right there. What kind of materials do we have? We've still got 62 logs. Firewood's fine. We have a bunch of food left. Stone. We have a bunch of iron as well. Alright, so our builder... Builders aren't quite done. Let's go ahead and add a second builder to try to get our food production started. And other than that, I think we need to get some housing going, but I'm not sure where I want to put the housing. So this is the spread out idea. We have our hunting lodge out here covering a huge area next to a forestry lodge so that it creates woods, which will also benefit the gathering hut. And we have our fish over here. Let's go ahead and build a boarding house? I think a boarding house will be good. Let's start with that. Or do we start with like a market or something? Storage barn, stockpile, market. Used to provide a localized area for citizens to, to collect food, tools, and fuel. This is the market. And a storage barn. A storage barn stores goods such as food, clothes, textiles, and tools. So stockpiles only raw goods. I think they also store stuff at houses. So I think we can just build some houses. What do we need a ton of stone for the houses if they're going to be built in stone. Uh, let's collect some more stone. area pretty well. I wonder if we can just build a wooden, I mean a stone house right here in the middle of the woods. I'm not sure where I want to put the housing. We could probably build a stone house right here. Maybe we could get another stone house here in the fishing area. Are our builders going to build anything? What are they doing? Logs and stone. We have a lot of logs left. Alright, and to go alongside these couple houses, I think we need way more houses than that. Let's get a stone house over here. I wonder if we can build a mining thing here on this uh, lot real quick. What would it be, a, an iron mine? Oh, I think we're going to be able to actually fit an iron mine here in some direction. Yeah, we can fit an iron mine right there. That's pretty sweet, so that I know I don't want to build my houses there. can build it in that direction as well. Yeah, I think right here is going to be the trick right in that area. So let's build a stone house down here. Or you know what, let's build it up here first. Right next to where they're kind of already living. And let's speed up time a little bit. Let's at least do 2x since we have our, our basic structures laid out here. You know, let's get this stuff built. 
And how's our stockpile looking? We have a bunch of stone stored. We have some iron. I think we're going to need to collect more stones to build up a few more houses. Like those ones. Probably all of these as well. All of those. That way we keep a lot of stone. Yeah, because they're adding and finishing the foundations for these things. They all pretty much take stone. Uh, we're going to go ahead and add a hunter instantly to the hunting cabin. I don't think there is anything like proficiency in this game. Like proficiency of activity. Um, but that's alright. I think we want to start producing food whenever possible. And along with that, we're also going to need a tailor house. Where is the building stuff? Alright, here we go. The tailor. How many clothes do we have? Right now we have 12 clothes. And we have 28 tools. So we instantly need to get a blacksmith. Well, we need a woodcutter too. So we need a woodcutter, a blacksmith, and a tailor. Right in the beginning. Um, I think we go with the woodcutter first. And the forestry lodge is going to be up here. So we can probably build a woodcutter's house right here. And they will kind of keep all of our things fully stocked for the winters. Which will be good. And they'll be close to the forestry house. So they should be able to get wood pretty quick. So that'll be good. And there's not much happening over here. Let's get our fishermen going. What are we low on? The reserve of stone is low. Well, we knew that was coming. All right, so we need to collect more stones. Uh, let's cancel this collection because it's not asking for iron yet. Let's just keep the stones going. Gonna collect all the stones to produce our stone houses. Alright, so that's got enough materials. We're still missing stone for this house. We are running a little bit short on iron as well. I think we have enough to build another house. What's the blacksmith take for iron? Iron for the uh, blacksmith here. Let's see. Yeah, it's still stone they're upset about. Where can we put a stone quarry? I guess we can put a stone quarry down here next to our our uh, iron mine. And that'll probably be really good if we can get that cooking. Um, the trading post is going to be good. Reserve of the logs is low now. Uh, let's get one gatherer and one forester. Because the forester is going to keep our wood production high. And we actually need to start clear cutting a little bit. We have enough stone there. Now we are out of wood. So let's quit collecting stone. And let's go ahead and move back to just kind of clear cutting this area here. Cut a little box out there. Cut a little, little box out here. Maybe take that one piece of iron. So this wood. Maybe not that little tiny baby tree that the forester just seeded. <laughs> um, we still have 15 people without homes. It's late summer, so we gotta hopefully get our homes built here soon. Are our builders doing anything? We have a couple builders that aren't building, or I guess they are building. The stone house should be getting put up. That stone house is up, so we'll have three houses. I think we may need another house. I think it makes sense to start them in stone. I mean, maybe it's not the right idea, but... Let's go ahead and put a house down here next to this tree. We can add on roads later. Uh, our food seems to be dropping a little bit. Even though we have three food gatherers. Um, let's go ahead with the hunter. Another gatherer. And honestly, let's get another fishing dock. 
So now we only have four laborers. But we got a couple of houses up, and then they're gonna produce children. Builder, gatherer, forester, hunter, child. All right, so we have... They're really not filling into the houses very quick. What does this house need? Stone, iron, and wood. We don't have very much wood. We need to clear cut some more stuff, I guess. Let's clear cut a bit of this. And we should probably just go ahead and take this little patch out there. Get these rocks. Probably get this whole bottom part. Just, just cut this whole bottom part up. Just go ahead and collect all of that. It's usually a little bit slower if you don't pick stuff specifically. Uh, amount of stored firewood. We're gonna need some firewood for the winter, so we probably should get a woodcutter going. We don't need as many builders, so let's drop a builder out. What are we missing? We're missing some logs. <clears throat> so hopefully we can get the logs pumping soon. We want to try to get more things built up here. The hunting cabin's working. The forester's lodge. I think we're going to want another hunting cabin over here, but we got to get the basic stuff built before we build more food gathering. Some homeless guy fishing, that's crazy. Um, is this foundation done? That foundation is done. We have a lot of people that are about to die from cold, I think. I think maybe stone houses wasn't the best idea. I wonder if we can build a boarding house here in the center. This is going to be bad, I think. Reserve of food is low and firewood. So that's not good. wonder how many we're going to lose if 13 adults. And we have a bunch of homeless people. We have five homeless people. I don't think I can actually turn this off. Uh, pause or unpause collection of materials and construction of this building. Yeah, let's let the build the boarding house finish. I think it's a decent idea to have a boarding house. We'll see if we make it through this uh, this winter. So let's let's get another hunter going. So that hunting cabin's maxed out. And what do we have? Another laborer, a couple laborers. Let's get the fishing dock. Another person. And we have still a lot of clothes. We're gonna need a blacksmith soon, I think. Uh, we can probably drop this builder for a, another laborer. We definitely need to be collecting firewood. They're still clear cutting that, so that's good. After all that, let's clear cut this little strip here. We're probably going to want to run through here and pick up all the stones and stuff as well. Reserve of food is low. Well, that doesn't sound fun. Where are they bringing the food? What? Where is this person? Oh, they're a laborer. I thought they had food from the, from the fish site. But they don't have anything. Now she's going to get food. And luckily there is some. But where is she going to get it? need a lot of logs. Oh, okay, the storage barn has food. Gotcha. Okay, cool. So I think we're going to want to build... <clears throat> the boarding house will cover that. Those people that are still homeless. The fishing dock we need to fill up. So we're at 14 now, so let's get another fisherman. I think we may even build a dirt road this way from the fishing hut. I mean, I don't even see where the people walk at, so... We may need to build a bridge. Where would we bridge to? I think we would bridge to down here, right? 
center island doesn't look too promising. I guess it doesn't make sense to build a bridge before you have like your first little island tapped out. So there's still clear cut in here. You can have them collect this iron and this stone. For this building logs and s logs and stone so they should already be doing that all right so we made it through the winter so that's good let's actually get rid of our wood cutter now we have a hundred wood what I just leave him there I put work and then he turns into a laborer I don't understand how the, that whole system works I guess I'll just leave it unfilled and make him into a laborer. Alright, so we got our stone houses here. We got four of them. The boarding house is going to come up. And then we're going to want a schoolhouse, I think. somewhere where it's pretty decent. That looks like a decent enough spot. How are we doing for materials? It looks like we have a lot of materials. Um, I know we're going to have to build a blacksmith here eventually. So where would we put our blacksmith at? And we're gonna need a tailor as well. I wonder if we build the herbalist before. And put that down here. I wonder if we put the herbalist in the middle. I don't really know how the herbalist works. Used to gather herbs and provide simple health and healing for citizens. Okay, so it actually has to gather its own stuff. I thought that's what the gatherer did. What does the gatherer do? Used to define an area for collection of roots and berries. 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 Um, I don't understand. So I guess I'll put the herbalist literally touching the gathering hut. Maybe not touching, but right in the area. So let's go ahead and pop that up. Hopefully they'll build that pretty quick. We got our guys clear cutting down there, so that's cool. Now we need to potentially law or add a bridge there. A wooden bridge. A tunnel, a stone road. I wonder if we put the bridge up here. get around up here? No, okay, so that's like a hill. Let's add the bridge, because then the quarry is going to be here. Where would we add the quarry? Let's look at that first. Alright, we can add the bridge over here. That seems good. I don't think it'll mess anything up. Oh yeah, we have to go back to having a builder now that has a foundation. The schoolhouse is going to be built. We need to clear cut some of this stuff as well. Probably all of that. Hopefully they build some stuff here soon. The herbalist, the schoolhouse, the boarding house. So the boarding house is getting built now. Um, we're down to 23 tools, so I think our next build is actually supposed to be a blacksmith. And he can be right in the center of town. Or 
right next to the supplies he will need. I wonder if I put him up this way instead. Does that interfere with our mine? No, okay. The mine is like a tile down. All right, cool, so let's put our blacksmith up here. I think that'll work well. And then we will have our mine built. Gathering hut, let's go ahead and bump you up another one for the winter. Hunting lodge is maxed out, fishing lodge is maxed out. So we're gonna want another forestry hut over here, along with a hunting cabin. I think. Alright, so we can build another forestry lodge here and not have it overlap too much, I don't think. Where does this one go to? That one's over there. So right here won't overlap. <clears throat> so that'll be good. We need another forest. What is? What are we low on? Reserve of the logs is low. That's fine. And then we need to build another hunting cabin. Let's go ahead and build the hunting cabin. Pretty much right next to it. Build it in this direction, I'd say. Maybe we build it over here. We don't want to overlap our resource gathering like that, I don't think. I think we want to have it spread out. In every other attempt I've had, I kind of just put everything all clumped together. And then it didn't really work out that good. Um, reserve of the logs is terribly low. What are we collecting over here? Cancel removal. Cancel removal of all the rocks and stuff. Let's go ahead and cut down some trees. We're going into early autumn, so we need to go ahead and get some firewood. And then we need to cut some firewood as well. But we don't have any at the moment, which is bad. So hopefully our four laborers can go ahead and get some firewood cut for us. And we'll cut it real close. We left some close to our, our thing for just this exact situation. Where we are out of wood going into winter. Let's drop our builder and have him cut down some trees. <clears throat> so hopefully we can get some wood cut, otherwise we might have some trouble here. Let's go ahead and cut all that close wood down there as well. Yeah, so then we have the Forester Lodge coming. We have the hunting cabin coming, schoolhouse, blacksmith, herbalist. The woodcutter's doing stuff. Our foresters aren't doing very much, but I think they take a while to ramp up. That's why we're kind of doing them early on. So hopefully our people will cut down more trees pretty quick. We need a lot more trees. Everyone has a place to live now because of the boarding house, so that's good. Now we can slowly build more housing as we uh, need more. Which will produce kids and stuff, which is good. So we can grow our population. And then the, I think the stone houses are just uh, quite a bit better overall. I think that's why they're more expensive. So we should probably put up another stone house over here, right? I don't know why we're putting it over here, but it seems like a decent idea. I wonder if there's enough room here for the market. Where is the market? Okay, yeah, there is. And it has 
has all the houses in it. Alright, cool. So we can add the market there later. So let's go ahead and add a stone house in this area, maybe. That should be clear cut soon, so we can add a house there. I'm not sure why I'm placing the houses where I'm placing them. I'm kind of just winging it and throwing them wherever. We do need to get more wood chopped, though. I wonder if they're running out of wood that's clicked on to be chopped. I don't think so, but we can go ahead and clear cut this forest that's close by. Try to get enough wood to survive the winter. The herbalist, the blacksmith. Oh, we need a builder. That's what we need. I was gonna say, why do we have all these foundations started and nothing actually getting built? It's because we don't have a builder set up. So the builder should be working. We're going to want to get what do we have. We have no stone. We have no wood. What foundations do we have left to plot? So we need logs for this as well as stone. We have another foundation somewhere, right? Yeah, log, stone, and iron. We have plenty of iron. So let's go ahead and get some, some logs built. Let's take the rest of these logs. Probably these ones as well. And then we're going to need to collect some stone. So let's go ahead and take all the stone in the area. Could probably take some trees from over here as well. So that'll be good. Man, the deer are just walking through the water. That's pretty wild. All right, we find it. it looks like we have enough food at the moment, so that's cool. Uh, the schoolhouse, I'm hoping, gets built pretty soon. That way, we can start training our people to be like better at whatever they're doing. I think they'll be a, a more efficient. I guess is what it says. Let's see what it say for the uh, schoolhouse. Used to educate citizens to be more productive. So hopefully, we can get some better operating people. We're, we're like in a series of expansion right now. I guess the whole game is pretty much just constant expansion. Uh, five laborers. It is spring now, so I feel like we can pull one of the laborers off. Because we're not going to freeze to death at the moment. Let's actually drop our woodcutter. Even though we need more wood, we're just going to drop that off for a second. Probably all the way until winter and then you know panic next winter too Like oh, no, we have no wood again. What happened? Why didn't we plan better for this? Uh, let's take some of the trees over here as well We need to get this stone picked up And probably this iron over here also I really just need like a bunch of laborers real quick. I wonder if I drop off a fisherman for laboring. The teacher I think we keep. The forester I think we keep because he's going to maintain a supply of trees for us to keep cutting. And then later on we'll be able to build a stone quarry. Our bridge, our bridge to more resources is popping up so that's really good. I think we're going to build a stone quarry down here or do I build the stone quarry somewhere else? I build the stone quarry over here. I mean, there's not really much else to be over here, so... I guess I just clear-cut this whole area. And put a stone quarry here and an iron mine there. I thought it made sense to put the iron mine right here, though. I wonder if, if there's anything better to do with this area here. There's not really a lot of usable land through here. I guess there is, though, because this whole area... And then you just tunnel underneath. And this whole area is 
gonna be good. There's a lot of stone over here, so I don't think I have to rush to build the stone quarry. It looks like there's a ton of stone. And the upper side, not, not much is going on in the upper side. I think we should build a fishing pond over here. Yeah, that's gonna be good. We could build fishing up here. Build a nice fishing dock. So that's cool. What are we low on? Reserve of stone is low. Well, I know. Makes sense. Everything's got a foundation already, right? Herbalist, we got we're gonna wanna get an herbalist pumping. That way we can keep our people healthy. The stone house is being built. What are we missing for that? Nothing. Just stone. Okay. I think we already have stone allocated to be picked up. <clears throat> so that's good. stone already, right? That one we weren't. Gotta get that little tiny stone. I guess we should start getting some of the stuff over here as well, right? We have plenty of iron. We just need a bunch of stone to be picked up. I think we cancel picking up this iron. Keep picking up the stone. Schoolhouse, zero students. We have a teacher, but zero students, so that's kind of lame. Where do we put another house at? Because I think that's the only way to build up your population, is to keep building housing. We'll build another one right, right next to that one, I guess. I think that'll be good. I don't even know where to uh, put that stuff yet. Where is the, where do my people walk at? Shows limited place, shows limits placed on resource production. Overhead map of the area. Oh, we should be, okay. So we can kind of make the top fully furnished or completed and then move on downwards. So that makes sense, we can build some some stuff up here and then slowly work our way down. So that's cool. Guess we can put that up in the corner. Log events, assign jobs to citizens, increase priority of the work being done in that area. All right. What is this blacksmith? We're down to nine tools. We need to get one working right away. Iron, log, iron, and coal. We don't have any coal. So I think soon we should build a trading guy. Is this the trading river? I think this is the river that trades. So I think we wanna build a trader here soon. Um, where is that at? Trading post. We can build them next to our fishing or we can build them down here. I think that messes up my quarry, but I think the trading post is actually probably more important. All right, looks like a good enough spot right there. What is this woodcutter? Autumn. All right, let's get our woodcutter pumping. We need to have wood for the autumn. Let's get another forestry guy working over on this side to regrow our trees. All right, so we have zero laborers left. Where do we get more laborers? We need our children to grow up faster. 
Um, is anything currently being built? I guess there are two things being built. So we need our builder. It's the teacher. The teacher is teaching one person, so that's good. Um, hunting, gathering. We only have one laborer, which isn't good. Where can we drop people from to help our laborer? Our herbalist is doing stuff, I think. We need our children to grow up a little bit faster. What are we low on? Reserve of iron is low. What is asking for iron? Okay, that is. That needs 40, and this needs 10. So we need to pick up some of this iron eventually. Oh, that's stone. Get the iron around that stuff. Get our little tiny bridge over here. All right, we need some more laborers somehow. What do we drop? I guess we maybe drop a fisherman. Do we drop a gatherer as well? I feel like the teacher is kind of, oh, well, they have two students now, so that's good. I was gonna say, what do we get rid of to speed up production? All right, what other tabs do we have? Tools and reports. Save camera locations for fast navigation of important town locations. Show the paths some citizens take. I can't even click on these guys. I don't even understand if this works. Okay, so they go from there to there. Where do they go? They go from there to there. He's going from there to there. That's pretty pretty solid. How many more people do that path? I guess they're laborers. They go from there to there. That's not bad. I guess we just put a piece of road here, right? piece of road here as well. Uh, what is wrong with our blacksmith? Alright, we're up to 46 tools. Let's get rid of the blacksmith for a while. So we don't need to build a bunch of stuff for the blacksmith. We have a ton of tools left. Oh, we need a tailor, like, right away. I didn't even, uh remember to build one of those where is that at I'm over here okay the tailor Tailor to be important. How do I? I think I just read something where I was like, oh, this is important now. Increase priority. I can't increase priority on the tailor. Okay. So, how do I pause this one? Yeah, let's pause that. And let's pause this. And let's get this tailor built. What do we need? Iron? We need iron. Iron's already allocated. Uh, what else do we need? We need stone and logs. Uh, we need a lot of logs. How come we don't have any trees? <laughs> we need some trees. Um, let's go ahead and pull... I guess it's got... It's already got everything there. We're just waiting for the builder to build it at this point. That's fine. I wonder if we get rid of one of our extra foresters for the time being to try to get some resources up. I think that makes sense. What are we missing? Reserve of logs is low. Yeah, I know. Need to get some, 
some logs. Along with iron and stone. I think we come down here and start clear cutting some stuff. What the heck's going on down there? Alright, so take all these logs. Take all the stone. Take this iron up top here. But third. And then let's let's try to get a dirt road over here, I guess. What path does this person take? Where's the pathing thing? Alright, they don't even show their path. Which is fine. It looks like they're just gonna go up there. Where would we put our stone mine? And that's cool. I can just pause this stuff, I guess. I can just pause this right away. And now I can build my, my roads around it. And then collect iron. No, let's build a quarry here, but pause it. Do I build the quarry here? I guess it makes sense. It doesn't really, it's, I don't think it's going to hurt anything to have a quarry there. Alright, let's pause the quarry production. And now we can kind of build our road around here. some students coming in. Uh, let's go ahead and build some roads here. I think that'll be helpful. So that's fine for now. Alright, we have reached max wood limit. So that's good. We can get rid of our wood cutter for the moment. Uh, we have plenty of tools built. Our tailor is getting constructed, so that's cool. Uh, what are we low on? We're low on wood, and we could probably put our forester back to work. Do we have a hunter in this one? We have a lot of food, so that's cool. I guess you can make children in the uh, boarding house, so that's good. That's good to know. Where is this guy going? He just went like straight across. Thank you. 
building a couple of diagonal roads here. actually do that let's get us another house going is our fishing thing built let's get us a fisherman over here uh, let's pick up this iron out here before we forget the top of the map let's get a couple big trees as well firewood left so that's fine got a lot of what do we need we need iron and stone let's get this built the trading post will let us get other resources that we couldn't normally get so let's do that um i don't think we want to collect all this iron but then again yeah we do so let's go ahead and just clear cut this whole area real quick and by real quick, I mean they'll eventually do it. Hopefully they hurry up and do it quick. This hunting cabin's got one. They've got one. Two fishermen over here. Let's get rid of the one fisherman over here. Two of four. Four of four. Okay, we have four fishermen. We have four hunters. Uh, let's get rid of some of these. We have one herbalist, three gatherers. Let's drop down to two gatherers. And then get our blacksmith moving. What's wrong with our blacksmith? We don't have a blacksmith. Let's get a blacksmith going. Wait, no, we don't need one. We have 43 tools still. The woodcutter, we have tons of wood left. Reserve of logs is low. We need more foresters. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and add a forester. Reserve of logs is low. We have no logs left. What is our teacher doing? Teaching four students, so that's good. We do need a tailor. We're down to one item of clothing left, so we need to get the tailor pumping. Um, our trading post has used all of our logs. But that's alright. Let's actually drop somebody out of our forestry lodge. Now that I'm thinking about it, we have too many in there, probably. And fishermen. We have a lot of fishermen, so let's get rid of two of them. I have one for each fishing outpost. And hopefully we can get some wood cut during the winter in this game. We need to build a bridge here. Let's go ahead and get the bridge started. Wooden bridge. Wooden bridge cannot be placed in this location. That's a big old bridge. How much? 60 wood? Is it less if I go from here? Doesn't even work. 60 wood anyway. 52 and 13. Okay. Well, we didn't cut everything down in this area yet. We have a little bit of clothing coming back. We need to get some trees. I think. I think we need trees. I also want to collect some of this iron. 
We need a bunch of stone as well. Let's get some of them trees. Get some of that iron. Let's go ahead and continue building our, our dirt road here. Okay, what do we have, seven students right now? We do, we have a lot of students. So that's working out. Hopefully they're gonna actually become adults soon so we can put them to work. We need people to work. We are running out of people to work even though it's been constantly growing. All right, we need to collect more stone. So let's go ahead and get some of this stone from over here. How's our clear cut going from over here? It's pretty far away, isn't it? I think this is closer to collect the stone over here first. I wonder if I just clear cut this big chunk right here, if that's what we need. Um, early spring and we're out of firewood. All right, let's get this stone built up. Because we need 80 stone for that. We don't need any iron for our stone quarry, but we do need stone for our iron quarry, so that's good. Good to know, I guess. Um, I don't know what our builder's doing. They're freezing because they don't have any firewood, so we need to get our woodcutter back online. We still have 39 tools, so that's fine. We're up to eight clothes. I wonder if we drop our tailor for the moment. I think we do. I think we get rid of our tailor for the moment. And have them go build some stuff. We have our fishing hut up here with one guy. Oh, we need to get this stone picked up. Before we forget to come back in this area. Alright, so that's all of the iron in that area. And then that little bit of stone right there we were missing, but that was it. We need to build a bit of a road here for whoever the heck's going up to this fishing. Alright, so we need to check up this guy's pathing. Where did he go? He disappeared. Is that him? That doesn't look like that pathing. Where's the fisherman at? Is that him? No. That's the hunter. Who's that? That's the gatherer. Where's my fisherman at? Does, it, does nobody work up here? Who the heck is that? I mean, I feel like I can kind of just assume where their pathing's gonna be. Oh, is it them? Or is that a laborer? No, that's a hunter. Okay. I think we just go ahead and build the most direct way. So I think that's what it'll be. But I'm not sure. Looked like he went around that side. Uh, we can go ahead and build a house up this way too, I think. Should be a decent place for a bunch of people to live. And then, what do we need now? We are running a little bit lower on tools, so let's go ahead and build a blacksmith again. We don't have any coal, so we can't get the coal going. 
All right, and we're at the hour mark, so let's go ahead and pause this and take a break, and we'll probably jump back into it. I kind of like the layout of how this is going, the, the, the idea of being spread out. And I kind of also like that we're just kind of in the top, and we can kind of move our way downwards and kind of expand everywhere. All right, so let's save it here, and we'll see you on the next one.